the chief guest, religious and political leaders present, other invited guests, the principal, head teacher and staff of Seta Junior School Mbalala, our dear parents, the people's fraternity, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Nabil Sheila Kafko, the president of Seta Junior School Mbalala for the year 2024 to 2025. I take this opportunity to welcome you all to this wonderful institution to grace this occasion. First of all, I thank the Almighty God for the gifts of life and all of you who have turned up today to bear witness to this historic event that marks the transition of leadership at Seta Junior School Mbalala. What we witness today is not just an event, but a testimony to the growth of democracy and good governance in our institution, and as well as the commitment by the institution to groom responsible leaders for this country. We, the young leaders, are very proud of Seta Junior School Mbalala for nurturing our leadership skills. Thank you, dear head teacher and staff, for this noble job. To the pupils of Seta Junior School Mbalala, my voters, I salute you. You are the reason I stand here today. Thank you for entrusting me with this huge responsibility of leading you. You made me who I am today, and I pledge to sincerely serve you. I will ensure as I will serve as a bridge between you and the school administration to ensure that this school is turned into a develop a better place for all of you and to help in the development of a whole child. To our parents, you have been and still are part of our success story. You encouraged us, you supported us, you prayed for us. Others even fasted for us to win the elections. God had you, and here we are, the leaders of this great school. Thank you, dear parents, especially my very own dear parents. Honorable Kisa Stephen, MP Luka South Constituency, and Miss Nagendo Sophie Kisa. If you are not mean, you may clap for them. And I request them to stand up for recognition. Very special frequent Your support wasn't in vain, and I thank you for being there for me. However, our leadership journey has just started. We shall now need you, your guidance, and support as we work to serve our electorate more, so fulfilling our pledges we made during campaigns as well as supporting the minister's project so that our cabinet and our contribution remains tangible and visible in Seta Junior School Mbalala. To my cabinet, I am talking to you. Leadership comes from God and it is a call to serve humanity. What we have come into isn't a bed of roses. It is a responsibility and dedicated servanthood. Let's serve the interests of those who put us in these offices. Let us fulfill our pledges and as well support the school in achieving its mission, vision, and core values. Your support towards the minister's project is paramount to its success. This leadership is a leadership of action. And I, and I say this one more time. If anyone feels not ready to serve, better resign now. We shall not need leaders who only work for the better of themselves. And like I said, this is a call to serve, not to be served. Therefore, let us dedicate all our time to serving the interests of our voters and those of the school, but not our personal interests. Your Excellency, the outgoing president and your cabinet, your service has been remarkable. My cabinet and I pledge to pick from where you have stopped. We hope to depend on your support as a foundation of our leadership. You are there before us, so please stand with us as we serve. We pray that God guides us in our service, and we also pray for journey mercies as you travel back to your different destinations. Thank you for listening to me. Education for a bright future, for God and my country.